for joining us first at four. I'm Christy Casciato. We begin in Oswego County where a head-on crash in Granby has taken the life of a Fulton teen and critically injured another. 17-year-old Riley Bartlett was driving north on 48 when her vehicle crossed into the southbound lane and struck another car. She died at the scene. News Channel 9's Iris St. Moran joining us now from G. Ray Bodley High School. Iris, such a difficult day there for the Fulton community. What have you heard as far as the investigation? What's the latest? Christy, the Oswego County Sheriff's Office is still investigating the crash. And as you said, Riley Bartlett was driving north on 48 when her 2010 Dodge Journey entered the southbound lane just after 530 last night. Her vehicle hit a car traveling in the southbound lane. The Sheriff's Office says the passengers in that car were taken to the hospital with non-life threatening injuries. Bartlett was pronounced dead at the scene. Her passenger is 16 year old Brady Niver of Fulton. Both were students at G. Ray Watley High School. The school district notifying families the crisis response team will have counseling available. I spoke with Fulton Mayor Dina Michaels and she said her police department contacted her right away and she says this crash impacts the entire community. We're close. We, you know, many of us know each other and news travels fast and, you know, regardless if we know them or not, it's still very, very difficult. And the the challenge is how do we, how do you move forward, right? These are young children, a lot of friends in their junior year of school, you know, school's getting, you know, just ready to wrap up. There's just so many thoughts that go through our minds. And Bartlett was a lacrosse player in the JV game against Cortland was canceled tonight. The school community coming together for a vigil right here at the high school at seven o'clock and her family asks that everyone wears pink to honor her. Live in Fulton, Iris St. Moran, News Channel 9.